and the devil has used this to to just haunt you through the years but God says he is going to deliver you from this thing of the past and this hurt from the past today and place this the point of contact on your breast and you've had a mammogram and there's no sign of cancer God is healing you now in the name of Jesus Christ be healed in Jesus it's a seed to me a seed that moves mountains Welcome to Don Stewart's Power and Mercy, where you'll witness the supernatural power of God transforming the lives of people just like you. Apostle Don Stewart is God's anointed vessel whose ministry of compassion has brought healing, deliverance, and prosperity to hurting people in over 80 countries and five continents for more than 40 years. What God has done for others, He'll do for you. Now, here's your host, Don Stewart. Hello, this is Don Stewart. A special greeting to all of my partners and supporters. I have something very special for you today. I'm going to tell you that I'm feeling led of God to give you a personal word from God. I feel led to call you. Now, if you are viewing this for the very first time, I want you to know that my ministry reaches out to hurting people. And if you would like to receive help from God, you need healing, you need a miracle from God, then I want you to call the number you see on the screen to receive the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief, 100% based on the Word of God. It's absolutely free prayer cloth that will help you just like it did in the Bible for the Apostle Paul when he sent forth handkerchiefs to the sick and those who were suffering. Now all you have to do is call that number right now or go to www.donstewarttv.com and receive the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief. Stay tuned. I'm going to tell you how you can receive a prophetic word from God as well as the Green Prosperity prayer handkerchief. Now, let's go into a service where God is moving. And anoint him with my tears. With my tears. Out of my broken bed. Out of my failure. I found my true call. I'm anointed to anoint. When I just looked back there at you just a moment, it was as if you lit up like a light. Somebody turned a light switch on. And I began to realize through the eye of the Spirit that God has called you into His service. I don't believe we've ever spoken to one another, have we? We have all right, I could see the call of God on your life. God has called you, and God is anointing you today. You are anointed to anoint in the name of Jesus. And God is going to stir up that gift within you. And this is a confirmation to your spirit, and this is a sign. I have to tell Bob, I have to tell Bobby, I, who is Bobby? Me. I have to tell Bobby that God has a new beginning for you. In Jesus' name, somebody help me praise him. I'm anointed, I'm anointed to anoint, oh, to call it Jesus' name. Oh, break open the box. Come here, Bobby. And anoint him with my tears, with my tears. out of my brokenness, out of my failure, I found my true calling, I'm anointed to anoint. 
It's out of your brokenness and out of your failures that God is birthing this ministry. <sighs> Bob, does this mean something to you? Yes, it does. Is this a confirmation to some things in your life? Yes. It's a prophetic word to you today. In the name of Jesus, you take this green prosperity handkerchief as your point of contact to release the anointing of God within your life. In Jesus' name. Thank you. I see within your heart, down deep there is some real hurt and pain that's happened to you a number of years ago and the devil has used this to to just haunt you through the years but God says he is going to deliver you from this thing of the past and this hurt from the past today this has affected your progress it's bought, brought a lot of sometimes even depression in your life but God is lifting that depression off of you do you know this woman am I telling her the truth yes all right God is lifting this depression off of you and balancing everything out in your life you are a very good person you have a lot to offer but the devil has just tormented you as I put this green prayer cloth upon your upon you today God is going to bring a deliverance in your life and he's going to go on the inside of you and he's going to wipe all of those hurts that happened even when you were a child away from you now in Jesus name somebody help me praise him I'm anointed to anoint I feel you I want to send you this green prosperity handkerchief just as I gave this young man, Bobby, this green prosperity handkerchief, as a point of contact for the anointing of God in his life, I want you to call the number you see on the screen. I believe this will become your point of contact to release the anointing of God in your life. And those hurts that you've had, those inner hurts and problems, when you get this, You'll just place it over your heart and ask God to heal your spirit. And God's going to set you free. Call that number right now. Does your heart need to be encouraged? Does your life need direction? Do you need a new beginning? If so, let Apostle Don Stewart be a vessel for God to flow through and bless you. When you call the number on your screen to ask for the free Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief, Apostle Stewart will be given your name and phone number so he can pray for you specifically. Then he'll call you back with a personal word from God to you. She called in to receive that green prayer cloth. And within three days of receiving it, she has had $57,000 of miracle money poured into her life. Michelle called in your TV program and received the green handkerchief, and she received $13,000. $7,800 and a new car. You sent her the green handkerchief, but God didn't give her a job. He gave her her own business. Don't just sit there. Get up and call the number on your screen and ask for your free green prosperity prayer handkerchief. When you do, your name and phone number will be given to Apostle Stewart so he can pray about your situation. Then he'll call you back personally with a prophetic word from God just for you. You received a thousand dollar check today at four o'clock. Your miracle is as close as your telephone. So call now. I always get so thrilled when I witness what God is doing in the lives of other people. You know, it would make me really happy if you really were touched of God today, too. I know that God has a special touch for all of my regular partners and friends who watch me all the time. I believe that God wants to give you a prophetic word from God along with the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief. When you call today, I'm going to get your name and I'm going to place that name in my hand and I'm going to pray. And then I'm going to call you with a prophetic word 
from God. So make sure you leave your telephone number. I'm going to call you with a prophetic word from God and send you the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief. Let me tell you and show you from the Word of God, because everything I do is based up on the Bible, the Word of God. In 1 Corinthians, the 12th chapter, the Apostle Paul lifts lists the different gifts of the Spirit that God has set in the church. In verse 10, he says, to another is given the working of miracles. Now, that's a gift that God has put into my life and has been operating in my life for over 45 years. That's why I use the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief. It's part of the working of miracles. You see, you have to do something, I do something, and God does something. That's the working of miracles. That's why it's important, number one, you go to the telephone and call. That's your part. My part, I prayed over this handkerchief I'm sending you. Then I take your name and I pray over it and I send this to you with instructions. Now, on in the 10th verse, it not only speaks about the working of miracles, but he said to another, the gift of prophecy. So God is also enabled me and anointed me in a prophetic anointing to give you, give you a word of direction, a word of encouragement, a word from God. So when you call today, when you call right now, I'm going to send you the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief as well as call you back in a short time and let you know what God has given me for you and prophesy to you. So go to the telephone right now and call that number. Brother Stewart, this is Sister Peggy Lewis, and she received the healing oil in the mail. And then when she took it, she used it as a point of contact, and she put it on her eyes and received an instant miracle. Woo! What was wrong with your eyes? The doctor told me that I was in the first stage of glaucoma, and I received the miracle oil from you. And you anointed your eyes. The Spirit told me to take this oil and pour it into my eyes. You poured the oil in your eyes. All right, and what happened? And for the last four years, I, they've been blurry. I put that oil in there, it came crystal clear. It just cleared up just like that? So God used that anointing oil as a point of contact. And how long had you been suffering from this? Almost four years. Almost four years. And when did this happen? This happened about two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. And you've been seeing clearly ever since? Ever since. I can see you very clearly. Am I as good looking as you thought? would be. <laughs> <laughs> how, how about all these people out here? Can you see them? I can see clearly now. The rain is gone. I can see clearly now. The rain is gone. Sing it with him. I can see all obstacles, obstacles in my way. Gone are those dark clouds it's gonna be a bright, bright, Listen, sunshine day. If you have glaucoma or a cataract or you have a hard time seeing out of one eye or both of your eyes stand up right now, you're gonna start seeing clearly too. I said you're gonna start seeing clearly too. I want you to put one hand over your eyes right now. If it's both eyes, put over both eyes. If it's one eye, just put the hand over the one eye that's bothering you. I'm going to pray, and somewhere in my prayer, I'm going to say, I command these eyes to be healed. When I say healed, you say healed. Everybody shout healed. All right, that's the way I want you to shout it. And God is going to clear up that eyesight right now. In the name of Jesus, that name that is above every name, I come against glaucoma. I come against cataracts. I come against the spirit of blindness. Uh, dim eyesight in the name of Jesus Christ I command you be healed healed in Jesus name healed in Jesus name now open your eyes and start seeing clearly I can see clearly now I can see clearly now the rain is gone what happened as I held this green prayer cloth in my hand 
And as I prayed the prayer of faith, what happened to you? I can see clear. How long has it been since you've been able to see like this? Five or six years. Five or six. Well, I mean, you told me to put your hands over the eye. There's, there's, there's blood. I have a dog call me and this one. And I had something move off of this one. And I very, when seen very well, when I come in, I have to scream out and look. And when I did that, and take a moment, everything that's bright enough. Cataract everything. surgeon. Here yeah, about two weeks ago, I had one eye did, I had the other one. But good God, can I see now? Lord, have mercy. You can see. Better now. I looked out there. I said, ooh, God, oh. clear. And it all started when you called for the green prayer cloth. That's right. I got it. It is absolutely amazing to me what God is doing in the lives of people. Let's just take time for a moment to hear some fantastic testimonies that people are writing to us. We're going to go to Brigitte right now, who's going to share with us a few of these testimonies. Reverend Stewart, we've got some amazing testimonies here today. People who've just been touched through this ministry and have just been blessed through the green prayer cloth. Let's start here. Brother Stewart, about three months ago, God healed my body. I was taking 12 pills a day. I was stressed, suffering from high blood pressure and overactive thyroid, fluid, and depression. I now know God as the healer. That is right. You told me God was going to heal me, and He did. Reverend Stewart, this comes from Jacqueline in North Carolina. Let's see, we have another awesome testimony here. Jay Jones says, God has healed me from depression, an aching back, leg, and knees. God was with my family through several hurricanes, and He blessed my entire family to get relocated to Raleigh. I thank Him that He could be here and come to your miracle crusade. God bless you, Don Stewart. One more. Dear Don, for many years I've watched you on TV. At one point, I was so depressed. You sent me a green prayer cloth, and I got an apartment, which was in my budget. I also got a job in one week. I thank God, and I thank you. And this is from Lucinda in New York. Reverend Stewart, I'm going to give this back to you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Bridgette. I get so thrilled when I hear what God is doing for people. You know, my friend, I want you to call right now. Call the number you see on the screen and receive the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief. The working of miracles is taking place as you call and receive this. Also, the gift of prophecy. I'm going to call you back with a prophetic word from God. Go to the telephone right now. I was getting ready to go take a mammogram for breast cancer, and I was scared when I went in there. And I got results the other day, said that everything is fine. You used, you used the point of contact and placed the point of contact on your breast, and you've had a mammogram, and there's no sign of cancer. No. You are free in Jesus' name. It's a sea to me, a sea that moves mountains. This is your time. This is your day. A seed, a seed of hope, a seed. God brought you here. You needed this confirmation of faith today. Hang on. God's going to touch you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. You're concerned about some other people. You're concerned about someone else today. You're burdened down for somebody else today. I hear a voice that says, Surely, surely, everything is all right. It's a sea to me. A sea that moves mountains.
It's a sea to me A sea that moves mountains Come here God has a tremendous blessing for you today He's going to strengthen your body He's going to not only strengthen your body, but I see God opening up a door for you. 1 Corinthians 16, 9 says, There's a great door open unto me, and there are many adversaries. The adversity has come up against you to keep you from going through this door. I, I, Ella, Ella, Ella who, who, who is Ella? Who's, who is Ella? Hey. In Jesus' name, it's the sea to me a sea that moves mountains and God is touching you God is touching your body in the name of Jesus Christ God is healing you now in the name of Jesus Christ be healed in Jesus it's a sea to me God's awesome ability to change lives is evident wherever the Holy Spirit leads Don Stewart. And you can be touched by his ministry right there in your own home. Call now and Don will send you the Green Prosperity Prayer Cloth that has been a source of inspiration for people just like you who needed to hear from God in a miraculous way. They said I had glaucoma. After you put this on your uh, eyes, you put the prayer cloth on your eyes, now you can see? The healing you need, the relationship you desire with people around you, the financial miracle you long for, this anointed prayer cloth could be the answer you've been looking for. Many will testify to the amazing answers to prayer they have received by faith. Since she received the Green Prosperity Handkerchief, she, he has given her two houses, a brand new car. She got $9,000 and her daughter got $16,000. When she got the handkerchief, two days later they called her and in one week she had a $19,400 settlement. The Green Prosperity Prayer Cloth is a point of contact and it's yours absolutely free. But you must make the call. Isn't it about time to make a bold step by joining your faith with a ministry that will agree with you in prayer for your miracle? Don't stall. Make the call now. Have you ever tried to live up to other people's expectations? I know I have. It's very stressful and very draining. Let me read to you out of the Bible in Deuteronomy 6.18. And you shall do what is right and good in the sight of the Lord, and that it may go well with you, and that you may go in and take possession of the good land. Don sings a song, Gotta Be Me. And do you know, that's, that's right. You've got to be you. I've got to be me in order to do what God wants us to do. That makes the difference. You've got to be you. Have you made the call yet to receive the Green Prosperity Prayer Handkerchief? 1 Corinthians, the 12th chapter, to another is giving the working of miracles. So I'm working with you. I need you to work with me because when you do, the two of us will work with God and great things will take place. So I'm gonna I want to send you that green prosperity prayer handkerchief. Along with that, when you call today, when you call now, this is something God has put on my heart for you today. When you call now, and even a little later on, if you make a vow, because I'm going to talk to you about making a vow in just a moment, I'm going to send you not only 
through the mail, but I'm going to call you with a prophetic word that God gives me. And I'll be calling you in a short time. It may take a few hours or may take a day, but I'm going to get right back to you. I'm going to get right back to you and call you with a prophetic word from God. So now go to the telephone and make that call. But right now, I want to pray for you. I have attached this green prosperity prayer handkerchief to my hand because this is the method in which God has given me. According to the Bible, the Apostle Paul sent forth handkerchiefs and aprons, and the Bible says, by the hands of Paul, these miracles took place. So I put the green handkerchief on my hand, and now I want you to point your hand towards this green handkerchief and believe God to touch you. I pray that God will touch you. I pray that He will heal you, prosper you in all of your ways. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen and amen. Oh, praise God. I believe God has done something for you today. Well, our time is almost up. I'm going to have to say goodbye to you, but I am going to give you an opportunity to make a vow of tithe in just a moment. So remember this, my friend. Until next time, this is Don Stewart saying, all things are possible if you only believe because God has something better for you.